Let's go ahead and stay on this with ABC News Chief Washington Correspondent and this week co-anchor Jonathan Carl joining us now. John, good morning to you. We have that new ABC News Washington Post Ipsos poll out this morning. So what's the big headline? It's quite a poll. It shows a continuation of what you've seen out on the trail, which is momentum for Kamala Harris. Uh, in this poll, the top line number, Geo, is Harris Walls at 50 percent, Trump Vance at 45 percent, a lead slightly outside of the margin of error. A month ago, this race was essentially tied. Now you see a slight lead for Kamala Harris. But if you look a little bit deeper into the poll, uh, you see some real big swings, especially, Geo among independent voters. Independent voters just a month ago favored Donald Trump. Now they favor Kamala Harris by double digits, 11 point lead among independents. I mean, John, this is a dramatic shift in this race. What strikes you the most in this poll? Well, when you look at what we call the attributes, how uh, the, the voters look at the, the candidates, if you look at these two questions, this is amazing, Gio. Uh, is the candidate physically fit, good enough physical health to be president? Uh, Harris has a 30 point lead over Donald Trump on that question. And a month ago, Donald Trump had a 31 point lead over Joe Biden. And then another question uh, has the mental sharpness, mental sharpness to be president. A month ago, uh, Trump had a 30 point lead. Now Kamala Harris has a nine point lead over Donald Trump on that. So those are the kinds of swings you just never see in polling. Of course, we have a different race now. It's a different uh, candidate at the top of the ticket for the Democrats. A very different race. And you there are in Chicago for the Democratic National Convention. It starts tomorrow, of course. Four days in prime time for, for, for Harris. I mean, this is, a, this is a big deal for her. So what do Democrats need to accomplish this week? Well, you know, they had been working, really, if you count the, the very beginnings of this, for two years to prepare for this convention. And they've had to rip up the script. It's basically an entirely new convention uh, that's going to be about Kamala Harris. She has to give the country a sense of who she is and fend off uh, Republican efforts to uh, portray her as a radical. You heard uh, in Mary Alice Park's piece, as a communist. She needs to go out there and show who she is and what her agenda is for the next uh, four years in contrast to what uh, the Republicans are saying about her. All right, Jonathan Carl, as always, thank you so much, my friend. And ABC News will cover the Democratic National Convention in Chicago this week, beginning Monday in prime time, streaming on ABC News Live at 7 p.m. Eastern, and then right here on the network at 10 p.m. Monday night. Tune in to a special edition of This Week Later this morning. Martha Raddatz is at the DNC in Chicago and will speak to Illinois Senator Tammy Duckworth and Mayor Brandon Johnson before the convention kicks off on Monday.